Thanks for joining us today on our one-to-one -one series on GCPS Tech Tips. If you look in the bottom right corner of your Chromebook screen, what do you see? That's right, the time. However, there is a lot hiding behind the time display for us to explore. When you click on the time in the bottom right corner, this opens the settings for your Chromebook. Here you will find several options. Along the top, you can sign out, power off, or lock your Chromebook. Remember, there is a big difference between locking your screen and turning off your Chromebook fully. If you need a reminder, be sure to check out our Chromebook introduction episode. You can connect to Wi-Fi networks outside of school, enable Bluetooth devices, and toggle on and off accessibility features here as well. Check out our previous videos to learn more about how you can use your Chromebook accessibility features. For notifications, you can toggle them on and off by clicking the icon, or you can customize by clicking the drop-down arrow. Screen captures can be started here, along with dimming your screen by turning on the nightlight to ease the strain on your eyes. Volume and brightness can be controlled with the keys along the top row of your Chromebook keyboard, or here at the bottom of your settings tray. To see an even more detailed view, click on the settings gear in the top right to open a new window. Here you might notice this icon that looks like a building. It just means that these settings are controlled by the district and can't be changed by you. Click on advanced on the left to see even more options, including changing the language displayed on your Chromebook. Customizing your settings can make using your Chromebook for school even easier. Be sure to join us next time for a tip on how to make the most of your screen space. Don't forget to like and subscribe.